did see that. I think that's pretty cool. Should be uh, interesting. I see uh, it's all that stuff pop up all over the place. I don't know if I'll check it out. I mean, sometimes I do, but um, I don't know. It depends. All right, I think we are good to continue the playthrough of Mass Effect 2. Hello, and welcome back. <laughs> uh, so today we have, I believe, Jack. We have Jack's um, playlist to continue. L uh, I look at it excited for the next Horizon game. I did like the first one. I played it a long time after it released. Um, but Horizon was pretty cool. So tonight we're going to be starting with Jack's loyalty mission and then Zaid. And then we'll see where else we go. Yo, what's going on? Bad, how you doing, man? Damn, everybody is here already. What the heck? What the heck? All video game news excite me. I don't even want like PlayStation that much, but I'll watch. Exactly. More games that people get into their hands. That is all that. Oh my God, Kiara. She fell. <laughs> Kiara just saved herself from falling off the bed. She was, she was literally holding on with all of her paws. <laughs> and she pulled herself back up. Oh, baby. <laughs> yeah, she was literally going. But she saved. She's good. She's good. Okay. So, uh, yeah, like I said, um, we're going to do this one, uh, Jack's mission first. And then we'll kind of go from there. We'll see, uh, see what happens. All that good stuff. Let's turn up the sound here. I am uh, feeling better than I than I did last night. Tonight, nine o'clock, nine nine fifteen. We're cutting the stream. I'm going to the gym because I need to. So regardless of where we're at, I'll save and we'll pick up tomorrow. Because tomorrow we'll have a few hours before our uh, our stream with the boys anyways. So. <laughs> that notification from Twitch does wonders. Yeah, it does. Only I wish it did was I wish... Um, I wish it, you could set it up where you could see other people um, when they change games. So, like, I wish there was a notification option. Like, yeah, when they go live... But then also for like certain people, I would love to see to have like game notifications go off too and be like, blah, blah, blah is now playing, has switched their category to blah, blah, blah. Because then I would be more inclined to, to watch um, certain people, especially if they're playing like a game that I'm like, oh, dude, I love that game. Like, I want to see them play it. So... I wish they had the option. Probe away. But cuz it, it there's definitely a lot more people I would tune into if like I knew like it's not nothing against the person obviously, but it's just Launching like probe. everybody is super interested. Like there's some games where I know some of my favorite streamers that I probe watch away. would never play. But if there was a day where they did start playing them, I would stop by if I have time. Um, there's actually only one person, which I would say is my favorite streamer, um, top streamer at least. Um, Lyric, he has somebody set up a, a Twitter account a while ago that follows his, uh, it follows his channel and whenever he changes games it sends a tweet out saying that he's now playing blah 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 so i follow that and i have notifications on for twitter for that so that way like one day if he wanted if he's playing a game and i'm like oh that seems really cool or oh i've wanted to see gameplay of this now i'll get that notification it's one of the really cool things i love about twitter Twitter and Twitch honestly go so well together. 
especially with connecting with other people like other streamers and just like getting on the spot like video game news before twitch i literally never never uh used twitter like ever i thought it was like kind of dumb Jesus, this this planet has is still rich. We're eating the rich today, boys. Eating the rich planets. <laughs> Probe away. This man living in 2050. Launching probe. <laughs> Keep going. Keep going. Ah, there we go. Probe away. Give me, give me. Give me them resources. Give me it all. Ooh. Ooh. Get in there. Probe. Trying to get my num over 30. Something sparked. Probe away. Wow. Launching probe. Got lucky there. All right, it's at moderate now. I think we're just about good. Let's see if we can find one more. One more good. Probe thing. away. All right, I wasn't expecting to do that much scanning, but that's all right. I'll take it. All right, let's go uh, go land here. And we're doing uh, Jack's loyalty mission here. So yeah, it requires Jack. Um, what is Tally's new uniform? She has three? Oh, I didn't even know she had three. That's cool. I don't know which one's the loyalty one. It might be this one. I'm assuming that one, but this one seems pretty cool too. Gotta go from now. I'll catch you later. All right, sounds good. Thank you for stopping by, Pilly Bob. <laughs> I appreciate it though. Thank you. Thank you for hanging out and chilling and chatting. All right, we're teaming up with Jack, Dane, uh, and Shepard. So this should be interesting. We got a heavy shockwave or improved shockwave. Um, shockwave's power strengthens, become a biotic freight train, swatting aside everything in the long path, taking out everything in a large strip in front of you. Let's do improved shockwave. And let's do pull. Heavy pull or pull field? Pull field it is. That's good. Um, we're gonna give Thane that. The more, more shitter ammo we can get for the whole squad, the more happy I'll be. So she has a shotgun. Let's give her the eviscerator. Eviscerator and exit. I forgot how much I hate this place. See the landing pad? Has to be on the roof, or the vegetation would overgrow it in a few hours. Shepard, I am picking up thermal signatures everywhere, except at your landing zone. Something's distorting the sensors. This was a secret Cerberus facility. Yeah, they build their equipment to last, assholes. It was a mistake coming back here, Shepard. Get a hold of yourself. It'll be okay. I'm fine. Okay, let's get on the ground. being attacked by a doggo. <laughs> I 
Bark Let's incoming. Just get in there and plant the bomb in myself. I want to watch this. Okay. Whenever I see a bark incoming, I'm gonna try and mute myself before it comes. I saw this room. I think they brought new kids in these containers. They were messed up and starving, but alive. Usually. This is unbelievable. Got it. The elusive man. Sounds like someone was working beyond their contract. He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. I remember escaping to this room, fighting here. I saw sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. Alright, let's unlock this. Ah, there's the bark. Favorite spot. Right underneath my chair for some reason. An animal. We've been spotted. This looks like an arena. That's right. They used to stage fights here, pit me against other kids. I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. Let's keep moving. <laughs> Hell yes. Security officer Zimkel, Telton facility. The subjects are out of their cells. They're tearing the place up. Subject Zero is going to get loose. I need permission to terminate. I repeat, permission to terminate. All subjects besides Zero are expendable. Keep Jack alive. Understood. I'll begin the... That's not right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. Things might have happened that you didn't see. The other kids attacked me. The guards attacked me. The automated systems attacked me. That doesn't leave lots of room for interpretation. Okay. This place is supposed to be empty. Who the fuck shot that? <laughs> it's ah. a fresh kill. Excuse me. Sorry, that was probably really loud. They've seen us. This room I Coming our way. Nothing can stop us. Nice. Get in there. small facility the other children must have died in great numbers even then they were part of the experiment bullshit i had the worst of it and i made it out alive it's 
so strange to be back here. I feel like I'm pissed off. I'm a dangerous bitch, but then I'm a little girl again. It's complicated. Let's just go plant that bomb. Interesting. We've been spotted. <laughs> Trying to save there. It's not letting me save. It smelled like water. So it smells like something might be back on. The air might be coming on. They kept children here. You smell that? Yeah, I was like chlorine. That is right. This. Oh, it's dude, a two-way I, I get a uh, I get a Saturday this on haircut. On the other side, <laughs> I could see all the other kids out here. I was about to I say that. I them for hours, and they always ignored me. I get a haircut on Saturday, and I can't wait because I feel like my hair is so long right now. I must have come through here when I broke out, but I don't remember it. This is a bad place. Sketch. No, really, there's a chair in the center with straps on it. Nope, that looks like a friendly place. Entry 1054, Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. Subjects one, four, and six died. No biotic change among the survivors. We lowered core temperatures of surviving subjects but no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect, all subjects died. So we'll not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children from my city. You can't help what they did to others. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. You move on, harder and tougher. Ah. It's all fallen to pieces. The subjects are rampaging and Zero is loose. We're shutting Kelton down. What a disaster. We'll infiltrate and piggyback onto the Alliance's Ascension program. Hopefully, that will give... Who oh, what? Zero, wait! Shepard, they started up somewhere else. Ascension is an Alliance program. It's a school for biotic kids. They don't torture children there. A lot of this isn't the way I remember it. There was a lot going on. I was dumb. I keep my eyes open now, and I always shoot first. We're getting close to my cell, the place I came from. Let's keep going. Huh. Hack research terminal. So, oh shoot. She's saying that they tortured people. Meanwhile, everything we've been seeing so far is like, no, we need to protect the kids. We can use this. Biotic damage. See, that, things like that make it all worth uh, hacking those terminals sometimes. Hey, Arash. It's Kira. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. You promised us lots of salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, we'll put them down. But I'm coming in there and we're going to talk salvage. Uh, why are you here? What are you doing here? First, we're going to kill you. Then we'll see. Kill them on my own. Not very smart.
is my old cell. Whoever a rush is, he's in there. I want to plant the bomb there anyway. Might as well do it on his corpse. Uh, okay. So, that's that. I feel like this new pistol really isn't that good. I thought it was supposed to be one of the better ones, but it like barely does any damage when I shoot at people. Or at least that's how it feels. I think that's right. Yep, right there. Puzzle solved. All right. Through this door. Through the next door. I think this is her. Uh... Come out. We know you're here. So. Who are you? My name is Resh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question, and I'm still looking for the answer. Looks like you're not the only one pulled back here, Jack. I tried to forget this, but a place like this, it doesn't forget you. It follows you. I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. I'm gonna find out what they knew, how to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. I wanted a hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? You'd do the same thing to new kids? Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth or kidnapped from colonies. Most ended up here the way I did. Batarian pirates. They did such horrible things to us. They must have had good reasons. There's no reason good enough. Are you nuts? You lived it. We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him we do with another you that's easy just leave me here this is where I belong fuck that Jack he's trapped in his past you need to move on from yours he wants to restart this place he needs to die he's crazy and he's never gonna restart this facility you have to let it go your past doesn't have to control you fuck get out of here go <laughs> He's not worth chasing. None of it is. You did the right thing, Jack. Maybe. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. Go ahead. Nothing's changed. But it's all different. War never changes. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being <laughs> tortured. I used to tie the sheets around that my wrists kind of and try to rip them off. I want to stop coming back here. I thought that room out there was the rest of the world. I'd pound and yell. Never did any good. Pound and yell. Me too. I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. Having a best friend as a table. Or a table as a best friend. I can't English tonight. Word tough. Man no speak correct. Blood smear. See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. Instead, I stopped him. Okay, no more wallowing. Let's blow this place to hell. Nice.
Talk about timing. <laughs> yo, Cozy Bear Live. Yo, thank you for the host there. I appreciate it. Hello and welcome, everybody. Yo, thank you very much. It's a raid. It's a setup. It's a setup. It's a setup. Yo, thank you very much for the raid. I appreciate it. How was your stream? What were you playing? And uh, welcome, everybody. Thank you very much. Also, just curious, you how'd you find my stream? <laughs> I'll deal with it. Take pictures. Hello, hello. Touch me and I will smear the wall <laughs> with you, bitch! Oh, God. Enough! Stand down, both of you. The cheerleader won't admit what Cerberus did to me was wrong. It wasn't Cerberus. All right, we Cerberus. can't pick a side. Not really. But clearly we you were a mistake. gotta defuse the situation. Screw you! You've got no idea what they put me through. Maybe it's time I showed you. Our mission is too important to let personal feelings get in the way. Fuck your feelings. <laughs> I just want her dead. You both know what we're up against. Save your anger for the collectors. I can put aside my differences. Jack said it first. Until the mission's over. Sure, I'll do my part. I'd hate to see her die before I get a chance to fillet her myself. You two gonna be okay? It's a good thing you came by when you did. As long as she does her job, we'll be fine. Thanks, Shepard. And here we go. Apparently GameStop is building an NFT platform on Ethereum. What? Thanks again, Shepard. Taking the time to help me with my sister. I couldn't have reached Ariana in time without your help. I'm glad Niket tried to redeem himself. For what good it did. Thank you for stopping me, Commander. Are you happy about your sister's relocation? She has what I wanted her to have. A normal life, and the freedom to choose her own path. And she knows she has an older sister. A friend. Are you gonna talk to her again? I honestly don't know. For once, I haven't planned that far ahead. I'll deal with it after our mission. I have to stay focused, and she needs time to adjust to her new home. Funny, I think of you as all business. Good to see that there's a person under there. The mission's too important to let personal feelings interfere. But thank you, Commander. My sister is safe again thanks in large part to you. I won't forget that. Sweet. Nice. All right. Uh, I guess we're on to the next one, right? Let's Rupert put the new supplies to good use. Go to uh, Zaid's mission, right? CIC. Head this way. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Access the terminal for what is it? Biotic blast. Do we get any other? So we could do biotic damage. It don't it's only fifteen hundred, so I'll take it. Armor upgrades, nothing there. Weapon upgrades, nothing there. Prototypes. Uh, subject zero biotic boost. You get 20% more. Heavy weapon ammo capacity? Uh, 3,000, sure. I don't know if I'll get any more though. But, uh, well, I guess never mind. I can't, anyways. Unless if I build the next weapon.
All right, Zaid's mission it is. So we're gonna get ready to head to, uh, wait, there's one more planet right here. This tiny, tiny planet. It's gonna be rich in resources, of course. launched. <laughs> it's always the small ones. Probe. While I'm doing this, uh, Launching not probe. so intense gameplay, I'm going to run this real quick. Just to turn off them pre-rolls. Launching probe. Nice. Keeping everything over 30 makes me feel uh, a little bit more comfortable. So that way we can not spend it all in one place. Launching probe. And if we do get something that costs like 12k or so, you don't feel as bad buying it when it does pop up. Launching probe. Now it's that good. Probe That's away. still pretty decent right there. All right, can we get some iridium? Give me some iridium. Probe away. A little bit of iridium. Launching probe. Went up about 500. Okay, it looks like we're back. Um, yeah, I don't know what happened there. It literally just like cut out on me, I guess. But I still had connection and everything. So, OBS just stopped working there for like two minutes. But uh, yeah, it looks like we're back. <laughs> I don't, I literally don't know what happened. That like never happens to me. Uh, it's once in a blue moon, so hopefully it stays that way. But yeah, I was literally just streaming and I look over and I see OBS is trying to reconnect. So yeah. But it looks like we're good, so hopefully we're set again. I don't think this stream actually ended either. Because it went into that state where, I guess... I, I think somehow that Twitch can detect when you, when you do a stop stream. And when you're actually doing a... Um, this planet is tiny. Tiny. And it's rich! and resources Probe away. <laughs> like I said it's always the tiny ones Probe launched. I, that would have been a bummer too I literally just ran ads too to turn off pre-rolls and they could have killed it launched all right we got still got plenty here come on where's it at i know it's coming up 
One thing I'm going to have to do at some point is since I'm definitely going to the gym tonight. I don't know when the last time I charged my headphones. So. <laughs> Yeah. Probe away. I'll have to do Probe that launched. soon. I just reminded myself. Probe launched. And apparently my girlfriend too. Probe launched. Alright, I think we're good. I, I don't really think we're gonna be needing much uh materials for much longer so we have a lot of the ship upgrades and all that stuff so with that let's hit land and we're taking zaid and i think i might take um wait what was um does jack have a new uniform she oh oh really <laughs> this whole time she had that one too I did not know that. Let's throw that one on. I think I'm gonna bring Kasumi. What is actually what's Zaid's abilities? Concussive shop, disruptive grenade, and inferno. Let's bring Kasumi. Why not? Concussive shot. Let's go disruptor ammo. I always like getting squad ammo. And then mercenary veteran. Health inferno grenade would be pretty cool. Concussive blast. Knock down multiple enemies, I'll take that. I think we need at least two points in this. Um, you know what, I'm probably not gonna use them often anyways, so. And we can't do any more with her. Zaid. Take the Mantis. Uh, take the Maddox. Exit. Liberate the refinery. Blue Sun's communications. Stay tight and look out for ambushes. Before we do that, let me plug in my phone. Yeah, right, lay down. Yeah. After this mission, I will uh, do those two things that I said I need to do, chat. Squad Bravo, a shuttle landed near your location. Check it out. Vito. Here we go. Keep close. Here we go. Keep close. That was the game lagging. Shut back left to rot. That's definitely Vito style. Let's it's crazy. Ahead. I think it's like two days. Um, Celesta 1.0 drops. I still haven't picked it up yet. I'm, I'm hoping that they have a 1.0 sale. If it goes on whatever sale it is, I will pick it up. But I guess I'll wait until at least, um, I finish Mass Effect 3 before starting the play now. Biomutant is out now, um, at the time of this um so that's pretty cool i haven't played it yet i think i have it fully downloaded but i've been watching some people's play the last few days um i've already said this a few times now that game had like i had no interest in it at first 
Um, then when I heard about like the, it's more of an RPG and like there's classes and all of that, that's when I got, I was like, okay, cool. Like, and then once I saw the customization, I thought it looked even cooler, but I'm kind of falling back into that. I, uh, it looks interesting, but I don't know if I want to dump a ton of hours into it when there's so many other games that I know that are, are very good that I still have yet to play. But I don't know, maybe I would like it a lot. It kind of, the th one thing with Biomune is it has that feeling where, in my opinion, I love Assassin's Creed. I play it for the lore. I play it for tons of reasons. But those games are long and they feel long too. And they drag out sometimes. So I personally, I feel like that I'd fall into that same uh, category for buying me. While the intruders are still alive, I'll kill you myself. Now get the hell back out there. Vito. Sounds like he hasn't changed. I get the feeling you have a past with this Vito. I knew he was a sadistic bastard back when we started the Blue Suns. The Suns only got meaner after he staged his little coup 20 years ago. So yeah, we have a past. Why didn't anyone tell me you founded the Blue Suns? Because it's not common knowledge. Hmm. Vito wiped me out of the records. He ran the books, I led the men. Worked real well for a while. Then Vito decided to start hiring Batarians. Cheaper labor, he said. Gotta have terrorists, I said. We'd better get moving. Gotta have terrorists, I say. He's looking like Cable with that arm right there. They know we're here. Bring it on, you son of a bitch! Zaid really is a uh, Mass Effect's version of Cable. Zaid Masani, you finally tracked me down. Vito. Don't be stupid, Vito. Zaid. I have a whole company of bloodthirsty bastards behind me, ready to kill or be killed on my command. Actually, take your shot. Give my men a reason to put you down like the mad dog you are again. What is going on with his arm? What was that? Gone nearsighted old friend. Burn you, son of a bitch. Damn. You just signed your death warrant, Masani. How do you survive? This whole place is burning already. What the hell are you doing? Opening the gate. We don't sacrifice lives for the sake of the mission. There's always a better way. Like what? Wandering out in the jungle for hours looking for another way in. You want to waste time out here? Go ahead. I'm going to kill Vito. Ho <laughs> ho. You're endangering lives and the mission for your own selfish revenge. You really want to do this, Shepard? I had to knock you the hell out. But thanks to you, we have a burning refinery to save. Let these people burn. Vito dies, whatever the cost. Defeat the burning sun, or the burning suns, the blue suns. <laughs> I mean. Probably halfway to the shuttle docks by now. 
You're willing to watch these people die? Damn right I am. We stop to help these people and Vito gets away. And if he gets away, I'm blaming you. We're here to free these people. We're going in. I knew this was a mistake. If we're gonna do this, we'd better get to it. Save the trapped workers. I love it when they're lined up like that right next to each other. Direct fuel. Salvage. The doors won't open until the fire's out. I'm working on it. get that palladium go 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 this looks interesting research activate fire extinguisher stop veto more palladium Take it. Shepard. Firestorm flamethrower, that's cool. Incoming. I like when they actually give us uh a weapon loadout like a stack after you get a new weapon it's pretty nice where am i going it's almost like it wants me to go there but there's a door over here Chaotic enough. Uh -huh. 
Kiara! Bork, 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 Bork. Should have seen that coming. Now you see me. Same thing. Was that the pilot? You just cost me 20 years of my life. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Oh. Zaid, you all right? The hell do you care? I'm fine. Now come on, get me out of this shithole. You put your revenge ahead of the mission. How can I trust that you'll be there when we need you? I'll do what I was goddamn paid to do, Shepard. Just don't expect any more than that. Now stop screwing around. Let's go. You put your own goals ahead of the mission. That's not the way this works. I've survived this long watching my own back. No time to worry about anyone else. You're part of a team now, Zaid. There's no way we can do this unless we're all working together. You... You have a point. I'm not done with Vito. But I can put that behind me long enough to get your mission done. Let's get the hell out of here. I thought we were about to walk away from him. He's a cool character. I, I wonder if the DLC people get dragged into the next game. Um, Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Cool. Anything else? Check the research. Up and upgrades. Okay. Um, hmm. All right, one second chat. Um, I am going to pause for a few minutes here, just run to the bathroom, uh, make sure my stuff is charging, my headphones, and then we will go ahead and continue. Um, so I will be right back in just a little bit.
Wade's mission. We also did uh, Jack's mission. So next is I think the Project Overlord mission. By let's see. Project Overlord it is. And then we're kind of basically there for the uh, missions. We have all the ship upgrades, all of that's done. Um, there is one more planet here, I just realized. Might as well, I think we're good on materials. Um, and yeah, let's go to the mass relay, head back over here. And fuel depot. Actually, yeah, we'll we'll fill up. Just so that's done and out the way. We'll also get our probes. That's good. Last my mass relay jump. And project overlord right here. Investigate Project Overlord. At this rate, I don't think we're gonna go 100% for investigating all of the areas anyways. So I'm just gonna start going towards the planets that we need to, or the area that we need to, cause we're almost at the end. So, land here. And we'll take, uh, so let's see, Zayin has some new armor, some red ones, that's cool. Let's take Thane and Kasumi. I don't know if we're going to be using both of them, but why not? Geth shield boost, I'm going to go AI hacking, because I feel like we're going to start running into a lot more Geth. That's fine, and that's fine, we can't even use the points anyways. Thane's good. Mantis. Actually, yeah, that's right. Tempest and Felix. Sounds good. Back to using this wonderful thing. Oh. Moving the camera around and Shepard can't keep up. You can. He like lags for two seconds. Uh oh, he's watching. Oh 
god. Cloaking. Can't get her. Salvage. Jeez. That's a mess. Use tram. when there's little I'm pathways like them. that. Going dark. <clears throat> it's interesting seeing that they're green like that because they're, they're gold by the VI. Send walkway. Attention. Satellite broadcast window is opening soon. All upload data must be approved by your department supervisor. This is sketchy. this there it is oh, no. down. I feel like I almost got wrecked
Okay. Head back up here. You need to destroy the support struts now. They have their own capacitors. Try blowing them up. Target right. Oh god, so much camera shake. Wait, how'd I turn that down? Why is there so much? Controls? No, no, why would it, it wouldn't be under controls? Graphics? Was there even a camera shake thing? Maybe there wasn't one. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Oh my god. You know, camera shake usually doesn't bother me, but it's on the level where it almost does. going on around here man's reach exceeding his grasp come on I'll explain which in summary you have my thanks commander Shepard you bought us some time though probably not much this isn't over yet Ah, great. You owe us that explanation. This is Project Overlord, an attempt to gain influence over the Geth by interfacing a human mind with a VI. The results have been less than satisfactory. I'd hate to see what you'd call a disaster. You can't dismiss the entire project. We did succeed, at least partially. My brother, David, volunteered to serve as a test subject, but his mind couldn't handle the VI connection. He's like a virus now, infecting our networks and seizing control of any technology he finds. It's why you had to destroy the dish. Imagine if his program got off-world. How does he take control of electronics? This is a hybrid intelligence the likes of which I've never seen. I don't know where the man ends and the machine begins. You should have considered that before you started the experiment. We couldn't be expected to account for every outcome. Certainly not the abomination David has become. David, the VI has fortified itself in the main laboratory at Atlas Station. It's in lockdown now. To enter, you need to manually override security from our facilities in the Prometheus and Vulcan stations. How does the lockdown work? It's a fail-safe procedure in the event of an emergency. Normally, all three project leads have to agree to cancel the lockdown. I'm the only one left now. I can give my authorization, but you'll have to manually reset the other two yourself. What happens if I have to kill your brother? Let's just hope it doesn't come to that. 
I'm heading out now. The other stations are all within driving distance. Best of luck, Commander. Huh. Okay. So we have to drive there with this thing, I'm assuming. Leave area. Speed. So we need to shut down each satellite, I guess. And once uh, the other two are done. Falcon and Prometheus stations and override the lockdown from each facility. Doesn't matter which one you hit first, but you can't enter Atlas Station until you've dealt with both. Also, keep an eye out for Cerberus security mechs. The VI has likely taken control of them. Archer out. You know what's funny? This map. This map reminds me of uh, Anthem. Press F to transition to Vulcan Station. So you can actually swap people out too if you wanted to. Um, let's go with these two again. I like that this one is actually going inside the facility and not just driving through it. I said if it is, I don't know. Commander, this is Archer. I advise extreme caution. Vulcan station is our geothermal plant. They stop reporting in shortly after the experiment. Scanning area. Analysis. The eye infection is present within plant machinery. Scanning area. Analysis. Vending stations provide adequate velocity to enhance vehicle lift. Exit Hammerhead. Warning. Automated controls are offline. Core systems have been compromised. Guessing we need to turn something on in here. get back be nice if you could just jump off how is it eight o'clock already chat how does time fly this fast uh, I feel like I, it just said like three o'clock not that long ago and here we are 
Not even kidding, this really is Mustafar. I wish they would recharge your shields when you hit them. Alright, now you can kill some of your abilities. Excuse me. There it is. <laughs> they start walking through the door before the door is even fully open. Please respond. 
I hear you, Doctor. We've hit the override at Vulcan Station and are moving on. <laughs> Who shot it? Shepard out. <laughs> All right, that's uh, part two. Got at least one more, potentially another. Commander, that was a daring piece of work. Vulcan Station was a success. You still need to go to Prometheus Station and override the lockdown from there. Good luck. So literally reminds me of Anthem. Threat detection. Enemy units nearby. Can't tell if I'm going the right way or the wrong way. Guess not. Don't think so. Initiating emergency reset. Guess not. Maybe that's where we exit from. It said 69. <laughs> it said 69 to uh, next station. <laughs> uh, okay, let's go Thane and do I want to go Thane and Garrus? Red or heavy Garrus have armor piercing ammo or change it up a little. Garrus, uh, use your points on this. Thane, you are good. Unfortunately, we don't have anything to add uh, to our um, ammo capacity. I don't know which, I forget which characters I have that have uh, squad ammo unlocked. Right here, my dude. 
Right here. Ah! No! Oh no, dude. Last one, too. That sucks. I bought. Damn it. Alright, I'm gonna, since we're doing this again, I'm gonna run this. Why is it moving faster this time? No way, no way. Stop, this is getting way too close right now. Please die, thank God. Still lurking, yeah, thank you very much, Nix. Had me nervous there. Attention visitors. This server's facility contains hot. Hold on one second, chat. Is a big geth boy. Hanging around all these dormant machines is creepy. It's like death staring at us. Wow, 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 wow. No throw. Reminds me of like a creepy AI uh, Fallout vault. Everything's off wire. Archer declared the lockdown power station. Infected. What does the VI want? It keeps screaming at us. Nobody understands. Always watching. The gaff are always watching. Personnel. In an effort to reduce workplace stress, 
<laughs> Scanning area. Analysis. The objective is located on the far side of this impasse. Um. I guess we have to get it in the center? Unless, wait, can you cycle between them? Oh, I think I understand now. Um, what's, does one of them change? Cycle floor panel, that's how it goes, that's how it goes, got it. Uh, okay, so technically we only need like two. Cycle floor panel. Up and then go left. Boom. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, what if you can just jump off? Okay. Then what about this? That'll work. Override complete. That's how I feel, Shepard. And there's the catch. I knew this was too easy. Come on, let's move. One. Two. Three. So let me guess, now we have to just fight our way out of here. Cerberus reminds all personnel that this emergency is now classified information. Disclosure to outside parties is a violation of your confidentiality agreement. Attention, this is a guest stasis alert. No activity 
<laughs> you try. They geth make like weird Pokemon sounding noises. Does a lot of damage. Or overload does a lot of damage now. Especially against yeah. Just like that, we're out of there. Locate Atlas Station. God that that can apply to real life. <laughs> Atlas Station. I should have known this was Atlas Station. Even though this is a multi mission level system or whatever you want to call it. It really doesn't feel too bad actually doing it. it seems to be fine. Uh, three points. Let's get that armor piercing. And for him, let's do shredder ammo. I wonder if you can have both armor piercing and shredder at the same time. That'd be interesting. This thing is almost done for. Looks like you're in, Commander. Good. Find the server room. Some troubling readings here, though. The VI is trying to upload its program directly from your location. Get to the server room and shut your log 155.2. For years, my brother's condition has been a handicap. That changed today. His autistic mind is the breakthrough 
Wait, so he did this. Damn, fat neck. <laughs> oh, it's actually opening. Wait, this door just closed on me. Summon to the seventh level floor. two. Resetting elevator. Resetting elevator. Resetting elevator. Arriving at level two. Arriving at level four. Arriving at level six. System malfunction. Arriving at level two. Arriving at level four. Arriving at level six. Arriving at level three. Arriving at level five. Arriving at level seven. Got it. That was weird. You have to go back. Oh God. Actually stressing me out a little bit. <laughs> Warning. Decelerator offline. Serious injury may occur. One of these has a log. I heard him talking. Uh one two Oh I am ah I missed it. It was right above there. weird the yeah, right. server console I wouldn't be surprised if this button summoned a reaper Like some matrix nonsense.
96.01 is 30.1. Square root of 912.04 is 30.2. Time on this project is running out. There are no options left. How to get the guests' attention? The robot says hello. Eureka, David. You're a miracle worker. Square root of 906.01 is 30.1. Square root of 912.04 is 30.2. David, can you repeat my notes from Thursday's experiment? Square root of 918.09 is 30.3. David, please pay attention. Loud. It's getting loud in here. I'm sorry, you didn't deserve that. Would you mind repeating my notes from Thursday's experiment? Log 137.3. The experiment yielded no discernible patterns of geth obedience. And dictation to David. Hell, the elusive man will have my head for this. Thank you. And how are you feeling today? Square root of 924.16 is 30.4. Earplugs will be good. <laughs> me to see this. How does he do it? David is a mathematical savant. His autistic mind can interpret the Geth language at its most basic form and mimic their phonetics. With his photographic memory cross-referencing a meaning snap, he's literally a human computer. And you think he can interface with the Geth's neural network? I do. Is that even safe, Doctor? I see no harm in finding out. How do I get in there? through here. Wait, can I actually just go straight through this? Oh my God. Are you kidding me? <sighs> Come on, man. I hope it's saved. Really? Square root of 906.01 is 30.1. Square root of 912.04 is 30.2. David, can you repeat my notes from Thursday's experiment? Square root of 918.09 is 30.3. David, please pay attention. Loud. It's getting loud in here. I'm sorry, you didn't deserve that. Would you mind repeating my notes from Thursday's experiment? Log 137.3. The experiment yielded no discernible patterns of geth obedience. End dictation now, David. Hell, the elusive man will have my head for this. Thank you. And how are you feeling today? Square root of 924.16 is 30.4. Earplugs will be good. This is like some system shock matrix craziness.
It's pretty cool though. I know I never did this before. Square root of 906.01 is 30.1. Square root of 912.04 is 30.2. See how this works. Pull the plug! Tell Vulcan Station to cut all power! It's too late. We've lost control. Attempting to establish a load link. Don't do anything rash. Rash? Like forcing your own brother into an experiment? I know how this must look, but I never intended any harm to come to him. You must believe me. It's not like I planned this. It was an accident. Seeing David communicate with the Geth, it all seemed harmless. And before you knew it, you were running your own private hell. I had no choice. The demands were incredible. The elusive man doesn't broker failure. Any war we fight with the Geth will be bloody. I was asked to find a way to avoid that. And how many have already died for this project? Yes, literally. More souls than will ever forgive me. Hold up there like that. But I won't apologize for radical ideas. If my work spares 
A million mothers mourning the loss of a million sons, my conscience will rest easy. Look at him. Your brother will never be the same. The damage may not be permanent. He might recover some semblance of his mind. So you'll sacrifice your brother's happiness for your own ambition? Square root of 906.01 equals... 30.1. What I've done to David is unethical. If he dies, it's unforgivable. Let me take care of him. Please. Quiet. Please, make it stop. I've seen enough of your cruelty to know he'll never be free from it here. I'm taking him away. No, leave him! He's too valuable! <laughs> You even think about coming after your brother, and this bullet will be waiting for you. Then we'll see who's valuable. Where will you take him? Grissom Academy. They can help special cases like David. Minus the torture. Joker, contact the Academy and let them know we've got someone who needs their help. Aye, aye, Commander. The elusive man can fire me if he doesn't like it. was a lot better than I was expecting. Holy crap, dude. The last part, <laughs> especially after we found out what happened, we'll probably see him in the next game, which Commander, is probably, which is pretty neat. Because um, I saw that that, that mission, that mission had a minor influence for the next game, which is neat. Uh, Shepard gets more health. I'll take that. Heavy muscle weave. I'll take that. Uh, plus 25 shield strength. Upgrade squad members with death shield technology. Why did we not do that before? Heavy weapon ammo. All right. Chat, I think we are just about there. We finished Project Overlord. The next one is the point of no return, which is acquire the Reaper IFF. I think we might have enough time just to finish that mission and then continue it tomorrow. So, before we get started on that, There it is. Before we get started, I am going to uh, make a drink real quick and then we will jump right into that and continue it. So I will be right back in a minute or two here and 